Alright guys, so I just got a call from the Lala Move driver saying that he's delivering a product from the guitar store Shiraz and let's check it out what it is Alright, here we go Alright, so this package has arrived and let us unbox the Roland FP30X. Let's go! Alright, first things first, let us unbox the keyboard stand. So this is the double X. There's double frame, double rods here for extra stability. So this is what we call an X stand. So, alright, let's put this aside right now. Alright, for the moment that we've been waiting for, let us unbox the Roland FP30X. Let's go! Alright, let me show you what's inside the box. As you can see, it comes with all the protective foam in the wrap. The keyboard is probably in this and it comes with the Roland DP2 pedal switch all right okay what else is in here okay the power adapter obviously you will need the power adapter to turn on the keyboard all right so there's two types the three pin and the two pin Oh, that's nice. Okay. All right, so let's go right ahead and take this keyboard out. What is this here? Oh, it comes with the stand as well. And this is the stand. I'll lay it all right down here later. Manual guide. Alright, of course you need a manual for this keyboard. Okay, so that's all. Let me bring out the keyboard and lay everything on the floor for you to see what comes in the box. Alright, the moment that we've all been waiting for. Let's check out the keyboard. Wow, so beautiful, right? So, right out of the box, we have the Roland FP30X digital keyboard and the music stand, the Roland DP2 pedal, the power brick with the 2 pin connector and the 3 pin connector plus the manual. Alright, now let's put them all together. And depending on your local music dealer, in this case, Guitar Store had thrown in this double X stand. 
to go along with this keyboard all right some other shops might provide with um, headphones and some other accessories so be sure to check out in your local music store all right let's go right ahead and set this up all right so before we set the digital piano to the stand let us make sure that the height is comfortable all right so let's make it a little lower As you can see, the width of the digital piano is not very wide, so it's only 30 cm. If I'm not mistaken, only 30 cm from here to this, from this end to this end is only 30 cm. So we gotta bring the rubber closer so that you will have a good grip on the piano. All right. So we're good to go. All right, before I connect all the required cables, let me show you the rear side of the keyboard. Here you have your pedal tool, which is to connect your triple pedal. In this case, this package doesn't come with that. You need to order that separately okay and that's pedal one so this is where we will connect our sustain pedal the roland dp2 here and you see what you have here you have usb memory you have usb computer right and you have your power inlet okay and your output, your right and left output. So we just need to connect the power adapter and the sustain pedal and we're good to go. Let's go. Alright, alright, now everything is hooked on. Let us turn on this digital keyboard for the first time. Wow, so beautiful, right? Alright, so you can see by default the piano is selected. So by default, it will be a piano patch. Let us play a middle C. Wow, it's really beautiful. The feel and touch is awesome. It really feels like a real piano. Man, I think it has this escapement feel. Look at this. There's a slight tension, right? Slight tension before you push fully down so it has that escapement feel right? 
like a real, like a real acoustic piano. Oh, let's have a go. Alright, let's check this out.
Alright guys, so here you have it, a quick uh, unboxing and review video of the Roland FP30X. I hope you enjoy it and that you have fun and please subscribe to this channel and learn more about this keyboard. I will upload a uh, more in-depth review of the features and function of the keyboard in a future video. Alright, take care and God bless. I'll catch you around next time.